a key aspect of a really good trainer is that they're interested in the people who are sitting in front of them. So often you people who have brought skills with them, but they're not necessarily trainers. They, uh, perhaps they're not confident actually standing in front of a group of people. Perhaps they're not confident enough in their own knowledge base and so they don't invite questions. The only way people learn if they, is if they refer back to the, the foundation that is their current learning and really you're building on that. For, for lots of people coming to, to training courses, they're not necessarily learning anything new. What they are learning is how to use their learning. Um, we use the Kirkpatrick model of ensuring that learning continues back into the, into the organisation. In the training, in, as, as we're, we're standing or sitting with a group of people, I suppose one of the keys is we, 12 would be the most that we would put into any, any uh, training room. Eight is usually the number because that way everybody's voice is heard. Within the first half, a, half an hour of a training session, every single person's voice is heard in that room. So there's nobody who's sitting back saying, I wasn't included, how come I wasn't included? That gives the trainer a sense of who the talkers in the room are, who the more quiet people are, what their learning styles are, because we listen to the language that they use. Some people use I see, some people use I hear, etc. We take that on board and that's the language we give back when we're actually training people. Uh, before the training happens at all, people complete a preparation sheet. So we again get a sense of what's the culture of the organisation in which they're working. More often than not, people come to training courses, they do them, there's no interest by the manager, there's no sense that actually this can be used back at the ranch, if you like. What we ensure is that their learning will be used. Do they have support? Where is their support? Most of the, the, uh, of the training that we do is actually in-house. While we do run public training courses, um, most of the, the work that we do is in-house. And we will talk to as senior a person as possible within that organisation to see how that training will actually go back into the organisation. I think if you don't do that, people leave, they've completed the stage one of Kirkpatrick, which is a happy sheet that says, yeah, that was a great day, great day out, now let's get back to the real world. And we're saying the real world only happens when you bring this training back with you.